Hello friends, welcome back. Misty Vale here. And we are doing a sneak peek of the beta of Ranch of Rivershine, as you can see for the next update. I'm uh, playing with some hair dyes here. But uh, yeah, I'll show you a little bit of the initial new questing and some other things and some more hairstyles. And uh, yeah, so let's get to it, shall we? Okay, so when you first log in, you will get this quest for Aisha. And then you'll get the quest for Orion. For Aisha, all you have to do is give her 20 manure and uh, she will teach you all the crafting recipes for all the different fertilizers. Now they have removed the fertilizer box by your garden plots. That's no longer in existence because now you're going to craft your own fertilizers. And I'll show you a little bit of that uh, later, what you will require. They have finally found a use for orchard grass, thank God. So once you give that uh, 20 manure to Aisha and then you go visit Orion you can buy hair dye from him and uh, you've already got the crafting recipes they'll be in your menu next to your inventory you just need to scroll down the next day or two you'll, you'll get this quest now where he wants you to gather a handful of red flowers it says around his house don't believe him it's not around his house you have to go down the hill a bit you'll see this ring of flowers right here and they will have right there, where I am right there. And uh, you will see anywhere from two to 10 red flowers. And every flower will give you between one and two flowers. So then all you have to do is harvest them up, take as many as you want or collect them all, take them back, complete the quest. But then he decides to throw a ringer at you. Yep, yeah, so he's, he's a crafty little guy. Cagey, I would say. As you're reading this, you'll come to the kicker in a moment and I could kick him myself. So uh, yeah, generous indeed, right? He's hidden the recipes all around on the different trails. There are, so there are two new boxes, new, two new chests in each zone, uh, except town and your ranch. So I will show you where the first box is. It is directly across from Orion's shop. Yep, you see three out of five. Doesn't do that until you complete this quest. Here's the first chest. The rest, well, we may make a guide later. <laughs> I know the people in the Discord are already making guides on it, so if you really wanna know, you can check it out there. But uh, here's the crafting recipes right under your inventory. So see, there's the red dye. You click on it. You will need three flowers to make one dye. And then for the fertilizers, uh, swift is orchard grass, rich is manure, uh, I mean not manure, oats. Um, shield is carrots and lucky is apple. And it tells you you're gonna need five manure and one of the other items to make the fertilizers. Now you're in charge of making your own fertilizer. The big box by your orchard is gone, replaced by the crafting. I kind of wish there was a crafting table that we could place down, but I understand it's not possible. So, but this gives us a use for some of the forageables that we didn't have. If you have too many apples or too many orchard grass or, or whatnot, you can definitely craft a manure to your heart's content. Um, and like I said, the flowers will be in different zones. So I will try and research and find out the exact listing for that. Here is, so you can see on the right how many color of dyes I have. If you hit one color dye and then hit another color of dye, it will change the dye. Um, but right now there is a bug where in the morning the original dye is still on your horse and not the secondary dye. So I've braided my horse's mane. And now I've put pink on it. And um, then you can go down. I don't have all the recipes because I did not buy all the recipes yet. I was a little broke at this time. They're a little pricey. But uh, yeah, so you can then go into the tail and look, I've braided the tail and put the pink on the tail. It looks really good on this flax and chestnut. Really, really pretty. I really like the braid. This is just a long tail braid. She's changed it. The tails and the manes are a little different. They used to be ribbony and now they're not ribbony and they're a little stiffer. So people have been complaining about that. Um, let's hope that she fixes it or I don't know if she may fix it or she may not fix it. I don't know, 
but um, people kind of prefer the, the riveting mane, uh, mane and tail, like it was before, to this stiff one, because it looks more natural, I think. But it, it could be that when you dye the hair, it looked a little different or wonky, so she had to do it this way. So we will find out if that stays or not. Here's another example. My pretty girl here. You braid the mane, and then I think I'm going to put... Uh, I don't know what color. Blue. That's very pretty on this horse. I really like this color. I might want a different braid, um, but I really like the um, these braids. And you can cut it. There's different braids for short, medium, long, and very long. So be aware of that. If you think you bought something and you can't find it, check under the other uh, lengths of hair, and it may be there. This is basically just the synopsis of what it is right now. But uh, yeah, this is how it goes. This is a different style of, of braiding for the mane. And I put a little bit of orange on it. I'm gonna try the rose tail for the, um, the tail, rose tail braid. I'm not familiar with it, but it went well with the rose tail. And here we have a different one. We're gonna do the waterfall, I think which is more like um, a show braid, I think. Whoa, we'll put some purple on. I'm really liking playing the colors. And you don't have to keep the same color for the tail that you do. You know, if you want to go wild, go wild. You can change it as often as you have uh, dye, whether you make it or you buy a, if you don't want to do the foraging and the crafting, you can always just go up to um, Orion and buy as many dyes as you want. And I hope you like it. I hope you enjoy it. And I'll try and play some more of the beta. But this is all we have so far. So thank you so much. Hope you have a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye now.